the public finances are managed. But the sad thing is that we have relapsed. We have not been consistent. We have always relapsed. What we need to do is to be consistent. So for instance, if the current fund program works well, and eventually we bring down the deficit to manageable levels, we're, we're able to stabilize the debt level and bring it down. Of course, that creates more room for the government to do big things. And maybe by that time, you know, the fund will have packed its books and left. Then when we're, we're on our own, we ought not to relapse and return to our old bad habits. Okay? It's when you manage your own finances well, you don't have to call outsiders to come in and help you. Then you can do the big things that you seek to do. Will, will the Made in Ghana campaign, as it is now, work in achieving that? Well, you know, I don't know about you, but I don't buy things based on a slogan. You know, I buy things because they're affordable and they're of good quality. So you can have a Made in Ghana campaign, which is good. But ultimately, if the products are expensive and of low quality, people will choose imports. And there's a welfare loss if you go out and actually buy something that, I mean, a personal welfare loss, and buy something that is costlier than an import and of, and of lower quality. So it's good to have a campaign like that. But as I said, you need to make the, the country a low-cost producer. You need to have stable prices, better infrastructure, um, um, uh, and a labor force that is better equipped with skills. You need these things. You know, they, they are the essentials. Well, we might as well say then that the trade ministry could be wasting its, its time with the Made in Ghana campaign because no, no. That the other things are not in place to... You know, it's, it, it should complement a fundamental strategy or it could be part of a singular package okay, to improve the performance of our industries. You know, but on its own, it cannot do much. It's not the first time... We have had a Made in Ghana campaign. You know. mm. There used to be a jungle on TV you know, a few years ago. Better Made in Ghana. You know, I, That's I can, true. You know, we've, we've done it before. And like I said, it's, it's a slogan. And people don't buy because of slogans. Because of slogans you know. uh, yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's a pleasure. We've we'll been speaking to Leslie Dwight Mensah, who is resident economist at the Institute for Fiscal Studies on the structure of the economy, how we could make it better, what its problems are, and how they could affect you and I, as far as living a better life here in Ghana is concerned. My name is Kemini Amano. This is Business Time. The program is brought to you in association with Lady Foods and Giant Malt, and is powered by the Business and Financial Times newspaper, which you'll find on your newsstand from Monday through to Friday, you find us throughout the week. But you can always log on to the bftonline.com to have up to the minute business news. My makeup is by Jubin House of Beauty. You find them two blocks opposite the police depot in the hat of Tessa. My costume is by June Berry. I'll be right back. Don't go away. Que quiero sentir tus labios besándome. Giant Mall is a non-alcoholic beverage which contains minerals and vitamins that gives you energy and power to keep you moving. Giant Mold brings out the giant in you. You're welcome back to Business Time. My name is Kimini Amano. Now, we've seen the conversation around the structure of the economy. We've also been through the major stories that made news over the week. Now it's time to look at activities on the commodities and forex markets over the week as well.
trading activities went on the commodities and forex market over the week. If you missed it, uh, there you have it. The program is brought to you in association with Lele Foods and Giant Malt and is powered by the Business and Financial Times newspaper, Africa's leading provider of business information. You find a newspaper on your newsstand from Monday through to Friday week. My makeup is by Jubin House of Beauty, you find in the heart of Tess and on two blocks opposite the police depot. And my costume is by June Berry. That's it. We'll see you next week, same time. Do make a date.